All right, Sketch Pad Podcast, we back. Make sure you like, share, subscribe to the page. It's lit tonight. So Kendrick just dropped another joint. So Drake dropped a joint, Kendrick dropped a joint on the same day. You know what I'm saying? It's like, okay, we gonna play now. So it's called, uh, it's called uh, Meet the Grammars. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Oh man, this is crazy. <laughs> he got a drug called Family Matters. And he got a drug called Meet the Girls. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Let's go, man. Listen, man, we be back. Sketch Pack, you know what it is. Hey man, listen man, we back. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. You want to get uh, your stuff reacted to the Sketch Pad. Look, right here, links on the page, links on the screen. If you want to donate Sketch Pad, you know what it is right there. You know what I'm saying? Cash app. Also, too, like, man. Hit the like button because it pushes us up in the algorithms before everybody or up there with everybody. Look, man. Oh, man. So we just got through reacting to, to Drake, which was crazy. Fire, Kendrick, dropped again. Here we go. Let's go. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father. Let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man. Your dad is not responsive. I look at him and wish your grandpa would have wore a condom. I'm sorry that you gotta grow up and then stand behind him like... God, no. <laughs> God, no. This is getting crazy. Niggas are saying that this battle ain't getting crazy. These dudes is going crazy. <laughs> no. No. Yo. Dog. <laughs> Dog. Oh my god. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father, let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man, your dad is not responsive. I look at him and wish your grandpa would have wore a condom. I'm sorry that you gotta grow up and then stand behind them Life is hard, I know The challenges always go beat us home Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grown And you're a good kid that need good leadership Let me be your mentor Since your daddy don't teach you shit Never let a man piss on your leg, son Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son Never fall in the... Oh my god, stop. He talking to the nigga son, bro oh. He talking to his son. He talking to his son, but look, bro, it's literally six minutes. Oh my god! Oh, this these dudes are playing dirty now, bro. Oh my god! Let's go. And behind them, life is hard, I know The challenges always go beat us home Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grown And you're a good kid that need good leadership Let me be your mentor, since your daddy don't teach you shit Never let a man piss on your legs, son Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son Never fall in the escort business, that's bad religion Please remember, you could be a bitch even if you got bitches Never code switch, whether right or wrong You're a black man, even if it don't benefit you goals do some push-ups get some discipline don't cut them corners like your daddy did fuck what ozempic did don't pay to play with them brazilians get a gym membership understand no throwing rocks and hiding hands that's law don't be ashamed about who you with that's how he treats your moms don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again be sure <laughs> yo <laughs> this shit is getting crazy oh my god bro these two dudes is going nuts <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Talk about slinging mud. 
Oh my God. Bro. Hold on, man. Let me pause this real quick. Let's go, man. 5% will comprehend, but 95 is lost. Be proud of who you are. Zimbic did. Don't pay to play with them Brazilians. Get a gym membership. Understand, no throwing rocks and hiding hands. That's law. Don't be ashamed about who you with. That's how he treats your moms. Don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again. Be sure. 5% will comprehend, but 95 is lost. Be proud of who you are. Your strength come from within Lot of superstars, that's real But your daddy ain't one of them And you nothing like him You'll carry yourself as king Can't understand me right now Just play this when you 18 Dear Sandra, your son got some habits I hope you don't undermine them Especially with all the girls that's hurt inside this climate You a woman so you know how it feels to be in alignment With emotions hoping a man can see you and not be blinded Dear Dennis, you gave birth to a master manipulator Even using you to prove who he is is a huge favor I think you should ask for more paper And more paper And more, uh, more paper I'm blaming you for all his gambling addictions Psychopath intuition The man that like to play victim You raised a horrible fucking person The nerve of you, Dennis Sandra, sit down What I'm about to say is heavy Now listen <clears throat> Your son's a <laughs> Oh, what the Yo, oh my god, yo <laughs> This guy is crazy, yo <laughs> Oh my god God damn God damn These dudes is going nuts this is crazy. Oh my God. Oh. Yo. <laughs> Man, bro. Let's go. The manipulator. Even using you to prove who he is is a huge favor. I think you should ask for more paper. And more paper. And more, uh, more paper. I'm blaming you for all his gambling addictions. Psychopath intuition. The man that like to play victim. You raised a horrible fucking person. The nerve for you, Dennis. Sandra, sit down. What I'm about to say is heavy. Now listen. <clears throat> Your son's a sick man with sick thoughts I think niggas like him should die Him and Weinstein should get fucked up in a cell for the rest they life He hates black women, hypersexualize him with kinks of an info fetish Grew facial hair because he understood being a beard just fit him better He got sex offenders on Hovio that he keep on a monthly allowance And a child should never be compromised and he keeping his child around him And we gotta raise our daughters knowing there's predators like him lurking Fuck a rap battle, he should die so all of these women can live with a purpose I've been in this industry 12 years, I'ma tell y'all one little secret It's some weird shit Going on, and some of these artists be here to police it. They be streamlining victims all inside of their home and calling them tender. Then leak videos, sell themselves to further push their agendas. To any woman that be playing this music, know that you're playing your sister. Or better yet, selling your niece to the weirdos, not the good ones. Cat Williams that gave you the truth, so I'ma get mine. The embassy about to get raided too, it's only a matter of time. Hey, LeBron, keep the family away. Hey, Curry, keep the family away. To anybody that embody the love for their kids, keep the family away. They looking at you too if you standing by him. Keep the family away i'm looking to shoot through any pervert that lives keep the family safe oh my god he's trying to ruin this dude oh my god whoa these dudes are playing they playing dirty bro man it's only a matter of time Hey, Lil Bron, keep the family away Hey, Curry, keep the family away To anybody that embody the love for their kids Keep the family away They looking at you too if you standing by him Keep the family away I'm looking to shoot through any pervert that lives Keep the family safe Dear baby girl I'm sorry that your father not active inside your world he don't commit to much but his music, yeah that's for sure He a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs Try to destroy families rather than taking care of his own Should be teaching you timetables or watching Frozen with you Or at your 11th birthday singing poems with you Instead he being Turks, paying for sex and popping perks Examples that you don't deserve I wanna tell you that you're loved, you're brave, you're kind You got a gift to change the world and can change your father's mind
mind Cause our children is the future But he lives inside confusion Money's always been illusion But that's the life he's used to His father probably didn't claim him neither History do repeats itself Sometimes it don't need a reason But I would like to say it's not your fault That he's hiding another child Give him grace This the reason I made Mr. Morale So our babies like you can cope later Give you some confidence to go through something It's hope later I never wanna hear you chasing man Cause it's felt behavior Sitting in the club with sugar daddies for validation You need to know that love is eternity and trumps all pain I tell you who your father is, just play this song when it rains Yes, he's a hit maker, songwriter, superstar, right? And a fucking dead beat that should never say more life Meet the Grams Dear Harbor, I know you probably thinking I wanted to crash your party But truthfully I don't have a hating bone in my body It's supposed to be a good exhibition within the game But you fucked up the moment you called out my family's name Why you had to stoop so low to discredit some decent people Guess integrity is lost when the metaphors doesn't reach you And I like to understand cause your house was never a home 37 but you showing up as a 7 year old You got gambling problems, drinking problems, pill popping and spending problems Bad with money, poor house, soliciting women problems Therapy's a lovely start, but I suggest some ayahuasca Strip the ego from the bottom I try to empathize with you Cause I know that you ain't been through nothing Crave entitlement But wanna be like so bad that it's puzzling No dominance Let's recap moments when you didn't fit in No secret handshakes with your friend No culture cachet to binge Just disrespecting your mother Identities on the fence Don't know which family would love you The skin that you living in Is compromised and personas Can't channel your masculine Even when standing next to a woman You a body shamer You go hide them baby mamas ain't ya You embarrassed of them That's not right that ain't how mama raised us Take that mask off I wanna see what's under them achievements Why well, believe you? You never gave us nothing to believe in Cause you lied about religious views You lied about your surgery You lied about your accent And your past tense All is perjury You lied about your ghost riders You lied about your crew members They all pussy You lied on them I know they all got you in them You lied about your son You lied about your daughter, huh? You lied about them other kids That's out there hoping that you come You lied about the only artists That can offer you some help Fuck a rap battle, this a long life battle with yourself He said it, bro, you too predictable And I told you So now, Drake got another kid <laughs> God. So, so, so so yeah, so what I got from that part, he's saying that Drake has another child with somebody else. Yeah. Not just the one that we see now. Yes. He has an eleven year old. That's what he's saying. Wow. He's saying he has an eleven year old. And he basically saying like 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 he t he was talking to him. He well, obviously you know he was talking to him because he said his name at the end. You know, he said his name at the end, so he was talking to him. So he talked to his whole family. And it's like, this is why Kendrick Lamar is, so, is such a genius, bro. This is exactly why. So what he did there was, as soon as Drake, as soon as Drake dropped his joint, and he knew Drake was going to do that. He knew he was going to talk about his family. He knew it, because there's nothing else you can say. As soon as he did that, he mm -hmm. dropped a song talking about his whole family. And how he's a fuck up. This is crazy. Yo, this battle is so fire to me, bro. This is fire. Because it's like, I like Drake and I like what he's doing. And I see what he's trying to go with it. But he can't keep up with Kendrick, bro. He can't. Like, he can't keep up with Kendrick, bro. Because Kendrick basically just came out and just talked to your son and told you to play the shit when you turn 18. Then he turned around and talked to your daughter. So... I can imagine him, his, let's just say for argument's sake, his son listens to the John, <laughs> listens to the John when he turned 18. <laughs> oh my God, bro. This, yo, this is certified 12, a hundred percent, bro. This is, this is a, I never seen somebody do a battle like that. Like, basically, like, call out the whole man's family and just tell the man. And he said at the end, 
this I only said this because I knew you was gonna talk about my family. So let's go. Oh my god, bro. Certified twelve, man. Man, this today's date? is crazy. What's today's date? Today is Saturday, May 4th. May 4th. You gonna, we all going to remember May 4th when Kendrick dropped two joints and Drake dropped one on the same day. <laughs> ah, this is great. <laughs> yeah, man. This is, uh, this is uh, hip-hop history. This is hip-hop history. Like, this is going to go down as one of the most craziest battles in hip hop two giants of artists going at it lyrically it's much more than respect at this point it's much more than respect it's legacy on the line now because after what Kendrick Lamar did in Euphoria then 616 LA now this and then Drake came up with family matters this is going to be very impactful this this might even change the landscape of how people look at Drake because what Kendrick just did, like you, there's so many emotions in this whole entire battle, bro. And you see how amped up we was when Drake dropped that track? And then mm -hmm. you come around and listen to Kendrick's joint and you see how he just deflated all that so quickly? If we compare the two reactions we just had, bro, we was amped up with Drake, right? Yeah. We come back over here, Kendrick was like, sit y'all asses down and listen. And he just gut punched everybody and everybody just calm down and relax. He just deflated the tires. My man had some 22s on his joint. He just deflated the tires. It was like, tss, relax. <sighs> this is fire, man. Certified 12, man. It's so much, man. It's so much to unpack on this song, man. I believe you you unpacked a good majority of it. Uh, I got to listen to it again, man. I, yo, I literally I said that on the last joint, right? I literally said... Kendrick probably gonna drop something right afterwards. <laughs> and he literally did that. <laughs> oh yeah. my God, bro. This is this is like I'm loving all this, bro. This is so exciting, bro, because these two dudes have sucked the air out of rap, bro. And it's everybody's just talking about these two dudes. They everywhere. And I think that <clears throat> with with Kendrick shows. And, and, and I'm, we going we gonna to get off of this. Uh, certified 12. Of course, you said Certified 12. Hey, man, look. Sketchpad Podcast. See you. Out of here. Peace. Bye.